Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Inside of today's video, we're going to be continuing on with our free to play to Masters series. So as you can see on the screen, uh, we've clawed back a little bit of ELO and for this episode as well, I'm not going to be able to play Max. I've been playing Max too much, so I'm not able to play Max in this video. So before we get into today's video, make sure you're using credit code in the shop. That'd be greatly appreciated. And without further ado, let's jump into the video. All right, guys, so hopping into the first game then. So a bit of a wild comp from the enemy here. They've got uh, Rosa and Tara in Hot Potato, which I'm guessing both of them are just want to be camping in the bushes the entirety of the game. So I went with Colt because I'm hoping I can break open them up a little bit, especially against the Rosa. So uh, hopefully we're able to start off the video with a dub so straight away uh of course looking at a composition i'm not sure who wants to go mid because amber probably is pretty good in mid as well and so is m so kind of got three mid brawlers here not really got the strongest comp on our side i'm hoping with amber and with colt we can break open the mid or burn down the grass and counter both of these uh brawlers that they've got so a uh, rose is going to be somewhere in this grass i'm pretty scared i'm just going to run up to be honest i don't really need to try and defend too much i'm hoping i can rely on my teammates just a little bit here as i try and deal damage to his safe so we're gonna auto aim uh, that super there onto the tara and now this is where the damage lies we can deal so much damage to the enemy safe and especially if nita doesn't have her bear or tara's not on the safe they haven't really got any damage that they can deal so in a really decent position here gonna just try and heal up waste as much time as possible uh, but anyway it's probably gonna pinch me here honestly but don't even really need to care about this rosa i don't know why our teammates are really caring about her because she doesn't really do too much damage uh, to be honest she should just be looking to try and get some control but she's pushing up just a little bit too much so one minute 30 left uh, already looking so so strong uh, amber with a super onto the safe as well so really now uh, we can just look to try and finish this game we don't really care about this tara we need to try sneak our way around she's going to use our pets but we've got a super to pierce through those pets and okay we're kind of getting uh, deleted right now this tara is actually really good across the wall so she's going to use her gadget not really getting a lot of damage done on the safe we're able to delete those so we're actually making a bit of a comeback here uh we'd really need to break out at least one of us uh break out to try and deal some damage to the enemy safe i'm just going to get uh, that rosa down but needs is going to do a lot of damage with her bear as well so they're making this comeback here we need to try and sneak up so uh, we've got our super here we're not going to waste it on the middle we need to try and get this onto the safe so we're just going to super all the way on that rosa rosa one shot and that should be the end of that game so really nice there actually pretty scary uh towards the middle bit of that game uh because they've got a lot of brawlers that are really good at wall peeking and pretty much all of our brawlers are trash at wall peeking. so going into the second game uh hopefully we can start off uh, the same again so as i said before i want to make uh this series a little bit more fun and enjoyable for you guys because uh, to be honest i don't want to just keep going the same brawlers every single time so let me know if you've got any suggestions on how to keep uh this series as exciting as possible because obviously the end goal is to get masters and try and be as sweaty as possible but at the same time you guys just were a bit frustrated to see me go in max every single game so we don't really want to do that and switch things up so going down the right hand lane here we can try and deal some damage to the safe tara with a damage gear is probably going to do a lot of damage to us we're just going to pop that gadget luckily enough we had enough hp to survive and we can continue to shred this safe so rosa going to run into us here we nearly got our nice chain there uh she just ran into us we nearly got that super off to kill her but now we've got no gadgets left uh, honestly if i had the other gadget with colt we'd be, be, we'd be having such a better time because we could just straight away use the gadget and break open the mid but we can't really do that so i'm kind of banking on uh getting rid of their safe uh dam well, their safe health a lot quicker amber's gonna connect on and we only have six percent left uh which is looking decent that was actually pretty scary because i saw anita go up there uh i thought honestly we're probably gonna lose that but uh, okay a minute left and we're looking really good and we can probably end it off here so I'm looking to try and get my super because they, none of them can really stop my super. Getting a few shots away from it. Someone's going to push up here and just finish off the game. So that's going to be the first one right there. Let's hop into the next one. All right, guys. So going on to probably the final game here. So uh, as you can see, unfortunately, we've had to go up power six Baron because Max was banned for this episode. It would have been a great pick against, uh, well, considering what brothers I had left on shooting star. So I've had to go over under leveled Baron, which is really, really painful. Uh, but hopefully we can still pop off. I uh, don't really want to go for the Colt either. Colt, not really the best in Bounty. Probably would have been a little bit better than Baron, but uh, again, would have been a little bit boring just to go to the same Brawlers. So maybe that could be a theme as well, just to constantly switch up the Brawlers every single time. So uh, going into the first game, then we've got a decent comp. Uh, obviously, they've got the Grom, which I'm going to be scared about, but I'm hoping that we can prevail. We've got the Brock to open up the mid. 
And I'm hoping this bell is pretty decent. So we've got to be really careful of this Piper. Piper's going to be able to just dominate us, uh, especially with that gadget. One tap literally from anyone. And she's able to finish us off with her gadgets. So Piper is really weak here. We should be looking to try and push up. Uh, I'm just going to heal up the Brock just a little bit. And uh, yeah, that's a nice kill from the Brock right there. So definitely opening up really strong. Brock is kind of popping off. Okay, we're getting tapped there. Piper's going to miss that gadget. We're going to work our way back over to the right. But this is perfect. Our teammates are pretty much carrying us here. Looks so like Piper's going to miss that shot again. I'm going to try and heal up our Brock. Okay, that just completely fails. And yeah, we're getting, we're getting carried right here. Definitely getting carried. There's no shame uh, to say that really. But uh, we're going to push up here. Looks like Piper is pretty weak. I want to... Okay, that was a wild voice cracker. Of course, it's whenever NX is on the edits. I'm just voice cracking like crazy. But we're going to be able to get the kill right there. And this is just plain easy. Of course, we're probably going to have to do another game because this is a little bit too easy. Actually, no, I haven't. Uh, we want to kind of stick to two uh, per episode. So we're going to keep this one right here. So it looks like uh, the Grom is uh, just spinning here. It looks like he's probably gave up. And yeah, I mean, you love to see. We all love an easy game. Uh, to be honest, I felt like this map is one of the ones that uh, it's easy to just run away with a game. Uh, I feel like other bounty maps can be a little bit messy, but normally just the better players just tend to win and shoot and star just because it's really open. It's uh, obviously catered towards the people that can hit more shots. But after all that talking, saying it's easy, we're only one star up. So maybe I need to stop talking and I need to be doing more. So 18 seconds left. But honestly, not in the best position here. I've, I've been talking our loss into existence. And I'm hoping we can at least pull away with a few kills. Okay, nice. So that's really nice from those teammates there. As I said, pretty much been getting carried this whole time. Uh, so that's a nice win in the first round. Let's try and carry it on to the next one. So the reason why I keep voice cracking, by the way, is because I've been doing really long videos. And sometimes it's really straining on my voice. So as you can tell, <laughs> I just managed to turn into a teenager again. With the voice cracks. But going into the next game. So... Of course, I, it goes to show that you can't really be too complacent in Brawl Stars uh, as I got. So we really actually nearly lost that game. So we need to try and focus for the whole duration of the match. Uh, but it looks like all of them are triple stack in my lane. Even though I didn't do anything that game, they just feel like they need to try and get this bar and down for whatever reason. Uh, so yeah, that is their tactic this game around. So we can't really push up too much on this Grum because his shots just like NASA. Like the Rockets just... I don't even know what I'm saying right now. But basically, his shots just reached the entire length of the map. It's just so annoying. Uh, <laughs> but anyways, I don't know what I'm saying. NX is probably shaking his head right now. Just like, why is this guy spoken right now? What is he on? Uh, but anyways, we should be able to get a double splash onto these guys. I'm pretty weak. Uh, we've got blue stars so we can afford uh, to die. Uh, we've got a minute left. The Brock with the tap. So I was actually saying before how... Uh, a lot of people do just constantly go Brock. But, I mean, if you're as good as a Brock as this guy, I can see a reason as to why you go him. But, uh, I mean, he has got a power 10 and he's popping off right here. So, we're going to try to keep him alive. We're just spamming him with heals. Eventually, he's going to go down because of that B-slow. And, yeah, it's looking kind of painful here. We really need to try and get a kill. We're going to obviously hit that pipe. Our pipe's going to go down there. And, Okay, we're going to get hit by that B. So we're only up by two stars. This isn't looking the best. I'm going to splash this bell to try and top it up with some HP. Uh, looks like I'm going to go really weak here. But we're just trying to focus our heals on our teammates. Because they've got the higher levels. And they're going to be doing a lot more damage. So we're getting cornered right here with a Grom. Just constantly throwing uh, his ammo onto us. So not looking the best. But it looks like our teammates are healed up a little bit. So we might be able to break out. That super's not going to connect on the Brock. And that's exactly what we wanted. And the Brock is popping off. So fair play to this Brock. He's absolutely clapped these guys. I've done nothing in this game. Uh, but we all will love an easy win. So that is going to be it for today's video. A nice quick one. But uh, again, I've spent so long on today's main channel video. Uh, that... Uh, this video is going to be a little bit shorter, unfortunately. But uh, hopefully you guys still enjoyed working our way onto Mythic halfway there. So yeah, that's going to be it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.